Hey guys, this is Sir Sniper 58 here doing another airsoft gun review. Um, this is on my new channel, Tech Airsoft, which is my airsoft team, Tech Airsoft Team. Webs.com. Um, we are based out of Lancaster, Pennsylvania, and today we are going to be doing another airsoft gun review. So this is the Echo One Stag Arms Mod 15. Um, this gun is shooting about 350 to 380 FPS with the point two gram BBs. I would suggest shooting a .23 um, either Matrix or TSD competition series pellet. Um, I just found that they work the best. Um, all the metal parts in this gun are the barrel assembly, the 300 round high cap winding magazine that you fill from the capacity holder there. Um, the trigger and trigger guard, the front and rear sights, and all the body pins, along with the charging handle, which has an adjustable hop up inside. That's what this gear is here. Okay, this features a version 2 gearbox, um, which makes the internals completely uh, upgradable. Like you can do pretty much whatever to it. I'm going to start doing a lot to mine, actually. Um, this right now is just bone stock. Um, it has a 14 millimeter counterclockwise thread outer barrel. Um, it has the adjustable rear sights, which you can either clip them. Like that. They're pretty nice. Fully metal. And it actually does have a windage thing here, but that doesn't really affect it that much really. Um, you can put it either, you know, over to the side, whatever. Um, it has, like I said, the adjustable hop up, and it also has a metal battery compartment for a large type battery. This is very nice. Okay. You guys can buy this gun for $175 off of ebike.com, which is where I would suggest getting it. Um, their shipping rates are great. Prices pretty much outbeat anyone else, and they just have a really, really good selection. So, what, when you buy from ebike, what will come with it is the AEG itself, a 9.6 volt, 1500 milliamp battery, um, a charger, which I would suggest getting a smart charger, that makes it a lot easier. Um, they can cost anywhere between $30 and $40, depending on where um, where you buy it. Uh, I would suggest just getting one with the gun, makes it a lot easier. Charges it, this gun, mine charges it in about 30 to 35 minutes, probably. Um, it also comes with the manual and a cleaning dash and jamming rod with it, so you're getting a really good gun out of this. Um, the plastic parts on this gun are... Uh, the upper and lower receivers, the outside of the stock, but the back, like I said, the actual butt plate is metal. The front foregrip and the flash tire. That's it. That's all the uh, plastic parts. Um, so most of this gun is metal. Um, this gun is 1,001 millimeters long and weighs 3,900 grams. So it's fairly light, um, but yes, it is very long, which does allow you to make it pretty accurate. Um, mine right now uh, is effective between 100 and 120 feet, which is really, really nice. Um, that's definitely about what a stock AG should be running. Um, this gun also, um, like I said, is fully upgradable. Um, I believe it comes with a 6.03 millimeter or 6.05 millimeter um, type or barrel, but I would suggest getting um, one of the Mad Bull 6.01 millimeter barrels, uh, which is a 590 millimeter inner barrel, um, and that will cost you about 44.99 on e-bike. Um, so that is probably your best bet. Uh, Mad Bull would make um, the, in my opinion, best type of barrels for AEGs. Um, I'm this gun does not have a three burst selector, it is a semi in full auto, which this, the full auto is shooting about 18 to 20 bullets per second with the 9.6 volt 1500 milliamp battery. So if you would switch to a LiPo battery, it would be shooting probably about 20 to 23-ish, I would guess. Um, I'm also getting an eight millimeter gearbox, um, a Sistema motor, um, a Prometheus spring, 
Um, I'm probably going to be putting an M130 spray in it. I'm just going to be making it shoot anywhere between 480, um, about 480 FPS, about. Um, with my 8mm gearbox and motor, that is easily sustainable. I'm also going to be getting a retractable Echo 1 crane stock um, that is has the two cheek rests, so it's in this triangle shape. Uh, I'm going to be running a LiPo battery in it, probably a 2000 milliamp um, small type. I'm going to have a small to large connector. I'm also getting um, two uh, weaver rail mounts, and I'm going to be holding um, an aluminum foregrip here, and probably either a laser or a flashlight attached. Um, the button would be attached to my foregrip. And I'm also getting a Umerix red dot sight to put right here where the rear sights are to make it just like the classic M16s were, which were really nice. They've been in service for over 40 years now. Um, and yeah, I would suggest buying this gun from ebike.com because they're great prices and it's just an overall really great built gun. Um, a lot of metal. It's a 1 1 scale to the real M16. Um, so yeah, check it out. Uh, ebike.com. I will post the link to the product in um, the description. And thanks, guys. See you.